Hey, hi, and welcome to this Five Minutes Friday. Man, I still find it pretty tough to talk against the camera instead of real people. But today I want to talk about my bushes. You know, they come in these nice shiny boxes from A to F. I want to explain a little bit what the types are and what you can do with it and what you can achieve with it. So enjoy. And please subscribe and hit the bell button. Well, first of all, I want to talk a little bit about uh, the types of bushes we have. We have several from A to F, coming in several colors. I think it's 20 from the lowest one. So, an A is SAMG. For show purpose, I stick to one color. It's a little bit straight up bush. It's not higher than three centimeters or tall, whatever you want to call it. Then we have the B types. They're also a little bit straight up, not growing widely. These are till five centimeters high. And as you see, they're pretty straight, growing up to the sun. Then we have the C types. They grow wider, still have this height of five centimeters, around two inches, something like that. And as you can see, compared to the B types, they're growing a little bit wider. Then our SDMG range of SD range, they're also widespread. You've got more, more bush, they're growing more sidewards. And they come until uh, somewhat more than two and a half, of two, uh, than an inch, two and a half centimeters, three centimeters. We have our E types. <laughs> That's funny. You have cars too that call E types. It's what you call tickets or ticket weeds or whatever. There are a couple of mats coming until two centimeter, three centimeters high. And the F types, same type of bush, they grow until 24 millimeters. You see they're compared and they look pretty natural and realistic. I'm gonna explain in the next couple of things how you're gonna use them. So when you open these shiny boxes, you see that the bushes are glued to a piece of card. It's for transportation only, remove it. And then tear and rip out a bush from the sheet till you have a little tiny circle where you can glue it on. Add some glue and put the bush in place. Add a second one, a third one. How many you wanna like, how many you wanna place. For the C types, there's a different approach I use. I get myself a pair of scissors. Grab a bush below by the other, by, by the bottom and just cut them. Yeah, and tear them out of the sheet. Well, sometimes it goes a little bit wrong and you need to peel out something more. And then you can trim it on the desired length. Add some glue. I said add some glue. And put a bush in place where you want it. This is the way I built my bushed areas. You know, I combine tall bushes shorter bushes, trim bushes, take D-types, round bushes. Most of the time, I'm adding a couple of uh, F or E-types. In this case, I used to use some F, I think it were F-types. Peel out something from the sheet of plastic they are made on, add some glue, and put them in place. Yeah, build up slowly, have a look at real nature, and then try to recreate it on your layout in scale. It's not that hard. 
peelout. Add some glue. Again. Doesn't matter which kind of glue, as long as it sticks. As you know, I prefer this uh, Uhu Alles Kleber or some kind of all purpose glue. And finally, what I like is to add a little bit of color. Yeah, brown bushes or bushes with color. Thanks for watching and see you the next time. Bye bye.